In Louisiana, the seafood industry has an economic impact of more than $2 billion each year. One in every 70 jobs is related to the industry. That is why lawmakers are cracking down on seafood brought from foreign countries that they say undercut prices and are not healthy to eat in some cases. They have different health standards because the way they track and trace and determine um, bacteria uh, is not as sophisticated as that of, of, of America. Congressman Troy Carter and Clay Higgins are bringing a bill to allow the FDA to destroy imported seafood they deem to be unsafe. It's easy for someone to then, in a secondary bootleg market, to get that shrimp, sell it at a much cheaper price, which then undercuts the clean produce that's being provided by fishermen who have gone the right route. They hope by allowing the FDA to get rid of any dangerous seafood, it can help keep people safer and push people to buy local. That's why we always promote good Louisiana seafood, good Louisiana shrimp, oysters, crawfish, and the like, because we know um, without a doubt uh, the, the estuaries that it comes from. Several bills were passed in the Louisiana legislative session to help with this issue. One new law requires restaurants to label foreign seafood. It also tries to prevent deceptive labeling to make people think that foreign seafood is from Louisiana. For your local election headquarters, I'm Shannon Hecht.